Welcome to Awesome Code. Please subscribe to my channel and like my video. In this video, we will learn how to encrypt a text file in C programming. Encryption means converting content into a coded format so that unauthorized person will be unable to see or access the original content of the file. A text file can be encrypted by applying a formula to the SQL of the content. So first I'm going to include standard IO library. We are going to read two files from a command line arguments. So first file will be a plain text file and then we are going to encrypt the text in that file and write it to the other file. So this would be our another include of a standard library dot edge include string dot edge and here we are going to define uh, oh we are just going to use the main function and int argc and arg v our argument array and the number of arguments and we are going to have two file pointers f in to read from a file and f out to write to a file and then we are going to have two variable i and n and then we are going to uh, define our car type buffer array so this would be car type buffer and i need to define the both size for our buffer Define both size set to 255, and this array will be above size. Now we are going to open our file to read from. So this will be our F I N for file input and this would be f open function and we are going to pass in uh, the file which we are going to read from so here will be a file name and it will be open in a read mode then we are going to check if there are any errors opening a file we are going to print the error message and exit the program. All does not exist. The file don't exist. So, and we are going to pass in the file, which is in our RB array at index one. And then we are going to exit the program by calling exit function and passing in one. So this is our checking. And now we are going to uh, open a file to which we are going to write the encrypted text so this will be our f out set to f open and this will be in our arc array at index 2 we are going to open it in our write mode 
and then do the same kind of file error checking if there is a error in creating our file we are going to print the error And then we are going to exit the program the same way. This will be exit. Now we are going to read from a file each line until the end of file. And we are going to subtract uh, 45 from our each character. So this would be while f get s and this will be our buffer and we are going to use a size of function and pause in our uh, buffer and then we will have our file input and we are going to check the return value is not equal to zero that means we have not reached the end of file yet so keep on reading so this will be sterling buffer we get the length of our uh, line and we are going to convert each character of that line or encrypt it so this will be uh, I said to zero uh, less than n and I plus plus and here will be our buffer I set to buffer the current character and we are going to subtract 45 from that character and save into a buffer and after we are done with that line we are going to write that encrypted line to our output file and pass in f out And after our while loop, when we are done, we are going to close those files by calling f close. So this will be for input file, and this will be for output file. Now we need to compile our program. I will use GCC compiler compile our program and then I will pass in the file name in crypt it dot C and then create the object file dash O and crypt it and just hit enter so our uh, object file is created so I'm going to run our code now by typing in encrypted and I'm going to pass in the text file name l.txt I have this text file over here it just has a one line and we are going to encrypt it so I need to pass in the output file where we are going to write the encrypted text so that will be encrypted.txt let's run our program and now I need to open encrypted.txt file and this is my encrypted.txt file uh, we can see the uh, that line is encrypted for us to keep on learning please subscribe to my channel awesome code like my video keep supporting me and thank you for watching